Hey family, it's me. Just come to you for a little bit tonight before I go to bed. Oh, I forgot to take my you and you. Excuse me. I ain't gonna start it. Okay, I'm gonna hold it up. Hold it up. I just come to you for this little ramp. It's been a minute since I had one going on. So how's everybody doing? What's everybody up to? How many people up late with me tonight? But I ain't going to be up long because I'm going to take my butt to bed. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I just popped in to say, hey, see how everybody was doing. We have a little chit-chat just to talk a little bit. Yeah. <sighs> you know what? Before I got on here, I wasn't even yawning. Now, all of a sudden, it's like I can't keep my eyes open. <laughs> but anyway... What are we going to talk about? Let's talk about uh, oh, these women that got these guys. These good guys, but they boring to them. So they want that excitement. You know what I mean? So they go out and get those guys. That ain't about nothing. I ain't got nothing going on. You know, the one you can take a chance on going to jail for or... He getting you caught up in something? <sighs> I don't understand it. Do you? It seems like when you get to be a certain age in life, you should be calmed down. And you got a kid, too. You should just be, you know, making that life with you and your kid and trying to be here for your kid. Because so many people nowadays... Shoot, they not here to see their kids. So y'all with my son. My son got killed in 2016. He left behind two little girls. Yeah, they big girls now. Mm-hmm. I'm sure y'all seen that picture. When y'all showed y'all the picture on his shelf with his little family. Yeah. Oh, wait. You know what? <sighs> oh, goodness. Wait a minute. <laughs> hey, this is me, Jazzy. Mm-hmm. Glamour. Did you guys uh, remember to like and subscribe to my channel? Thumbs up the video. Thumbs up the video. You know, it really helped with that, other, with that algorithm stuff. I see my numbers moving again, but you know what? That don't mean nothing. They move and then they stop. They move and then they stop. So I'm trying to get back on track. So... Oh, man, it's my bedtime. So, um, you guys help a sister out. Like I said, leave a comment. If you don't want to leave a comment, just leave an emoji down there. So I can uh, get back on track where I was before, before life happened. And I had to move. And I will stop making the videos for a minute. So, yeah, I got some videos in my phone I need to put out. Man, this is crazy. I just can't stop. But, um, yeah. I'm getting back to the conversation about, uh, people. I guess men and women, you know, they have a good thing. But, you know, what? they be thinking the grass is green on the other side. Man, that grass don't be green at all. It looks like it. They had that old invitation grass. You know that old grass you buy at, um, what is that, Home Depot, and you put down? That's what they see. They think it's real. It's real. That old fake-ass grass. Mm-mm. Yeah, but I don't understand it, though. Maybe the way. Oh, goodness. Woo. Maybe y'all can help me understand it. Why when you have a good thing, you don't appreciate it. You know what I mean? Yep. Yeah, I know some people. They got a good man. But they say, shit, he boring. He ain't about that life. So they want to go out and be about that life. You know, sometimes being about that life ain't good. 
There's consequences, repercussions. It's just too much. So, yeah. So. Uh, uh, ooh. Man, y'all see all in my mouth, huh? <laughs> ah, yeah, that right there was a big one. It was like, oh, my goodness. But anyway, yeah, I don't understand it. But, um, yeah, you know. Mm-hmm. I don't know. It's so strange, though. I can see it. They always say good guys and good girls finish last. There might be some truth to that, huh? You think so? Mm-hmm. I was talking to my kid's father. You know, he in Ohio. We talk all the time. We have a good relationship. I have a good, I have a good friendship with my kid's father and my ex-husband. You know, so I talk to him. Yeah, so, you know, we have a pretty cool little friendship. But mainly my kids father in Ohio, we talk all the time. He called me. Oh, oh excuse me. He be calling me late at night. I don't want to talk him up because he been trying to call me tonight. It's like almost 12. I think it's 11 o'clock here. I don't know. It's late here. But he be calling me and be want to stay on the phone. But anyway, he called me a couple of weeks ago. Supposed to met this woman, this white woman. And, uh. I don't know, I guess he thought that um, she was all that, I guess. I don't know. But every time me and him on the phone, she'd be in the background talking. She was always standing in the bathroom. Always in the bathroom. I'm like, man, why is this woman always in the bathroom? You know? And, uh, mm -mm. <sighs> she wanted to send me something for my birthday. She wanted to get on the phone and talk with me. I'll talk to her. You know what I'm saying? I'm cool like that. But, um, <laughs> yeah. So he called me yesterday or Saturday. Yesterday was Sunday. I don't know if he called me Saturday or Sunday. Told me how the, um, the woman was, was in the bathroom getting high. Ain't that something? Remember I showed y'all those silver dollars and 50 cent pieces he sent for the grandkids? He said he had a bunch of them to send. And she stole them. So he really got mad then. Talking about she was stealing from his grandkids and stuff. So, but, uh, he ended up putting her out. I knew it was something fishy about her, but, you know, you can't tell people about their relationships and who they talking to. You just let them learn for themselves. So I ain't say nothing. Just, you know. <sighs> I was cool. But yeah, he called and told me all the little stuff that was going on. Ain't that something? I was just surprised. But I knew something was up. He was saying how he um just wasted his time and money because uh, that he invested. But I'm glad it was a short while. I told him, shit, it wasn't no years. You know, it was a few months. You know, but he claimed she learned, he learned his lesson. I said, yeah, when you meet people, you got to check them out. You know, you just can't jump up there and move them in because he moved her in. You just can't jump up there and be moving people in with you nowadays. Nowadays, people is for they self, so... <sighs> It's so sad, but it's so true. Yeah. Oh, I got on the other little outfit from Victoria's Secret. Look at that big old V from Victoria. Then I got the little shorts on. Wait, let me see. The little colorful shorts. Remember the other night I had the other ones on. So this is what I got on tonight. This is my little sleeping attire tonight. A little short set from Victoria's Secret from Vicky House. But, um, yeah, you know. Then some of her family people didn't even like blacks. I told him that's too much now. How you know she with the um but even though a lot of white people don't like black people huh? her family was having functions and he couldn't even go because they didn't like uh what you call it. I told him I don't know how that's gonna work out. But um 
I guess when he put her out and he and they came to get her, you know, the granny was talking crap, but the grandfather said he know that she was doing the same thing when she was over there with them in the bathroom, getting high. They gone. Got people coming over. Yeah, his neighbor told him that while he was gone, she had some other man coming over there. I was like, what? Ain't that something? But uh, I told him, yeah. I told him, don't let her come back. Because he said he got her car to impound. I said, well, when she give you money, give her the car back. But don't, uh, but don't get yourself in no trouble. Do you know what I mean? Because trouble is easy to get into and it's hell to get out. Boy, I mean hell to get out. But yeah, I just want to pop in really and talk about um some of these young people got these uh you know good guys try to be family men, but they they want them old thugs out there that's out here with these guns and drugs and stuff, you know. Then when your ass get in trouble, you hollering for your mama. Mm -mm. Mama ain't gonna always be there, so you better get it right while you can. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I think that's it. I'm in this video right now because I'm tired. Uh, uh, excuse me. I just want to come through because I'm trying to keep putting videos out so I keep my numbers moving. Mm -hmm. Thank God my numbers moving. And uh, yeah, the other little mixture video I put up with the little shoes and the suit from Ross and showing my house. Because you know what? I be recording videos. Ahead of time, and then I forget and may leave off a piece. Thought I added it, but I didn't. So that little mixture was some little pieces of video that should have been added to another video. So I just made a little hodgepodge. It was all right. Yep. So Halloween. Oh yeah, Halloween is Monday. Anybody got any plans? Anything exciting? I'm gonna put out my video with the Halloween lingerie. I'm going to get that together so I can uh, put that out. So anyway, it's been great, but it's getting late. You see, I can't stop yawning. Yeah, so peace, love, and blessings. Hey, and have a good night. And don't forget, subscribe to my channel and thumbs up the video. All right, peace out.